Hello everyone, welcome to the howto.org channel. To log in to our Hotmail or Outlook mail, the first thing we'll do is go to the official website, outlook.com. For those who didn't know, Hotmail is currently called Outlook. If you created your mail with hotmail.com, no problem, you can still log in here. After that, we click on sign in. Now we have to write our email. Then we write our password. Click on sign in to log in. If you want to save your password in your browser, click on save. If you don't want it to be saved, click on never. As we see, here we are in our mail. This is our inbox. Here appear all the messages that have been sent to us. The light blue ones are the ones that have not been read. In order to read it, we only need to click and it will open. Here is the message. If we want to delete it, we just click on the more actions button. Then we choose the option, delete. We go back to inbox. We can also select several messages at the same time. Just click on the circle on the left side. When the check appears it's because it's selected. Once we select these three, I'll click on delete. Those messages were deleted. But we can still see it, on the left side, we go down with the scroll and click on the folder, deleted items. Here we can see all the deleted messages. I'm going to select four messages and then right click, choose the option, restore. These messages have returned to the inbox. Now, to send an email, we click on, new message. In two, we write the mail or mails of the recipients. I will write Amy Wilson at hotmail.com. To add it, I must press the comma key after writing the mail. If I want to add several emails in a single message, we must separate each email by commas. We write the subject of the message. Then in the larger space, we write the complete message. If we want to add an image, we click on the icon located at the bottom. Then we double click on the image we want to upload. We see that it appears inside the message. It takes up a lot of space. I'm going to click on the image and press delete. The best way to send a photo, image, document or video is as an attachment. I will click on the attach button. Then I will choose the option, browse this computer. I will double click on the image I want to add. Here we see how it looks like an attachment. We can also add documents. I will make an example with a PDF file. We can also add videos. Once the message is finished, we will click on send. If you want to see the mail you have sent, we click on the send items folder. Here we can see the mail we sent a moment ago. We can see the exact time and date. Now, if you have finished using your mail for today. To close it, just click on the top right, on the circle. Then click on, sign out. There, that's it. Thank you for watching our video, we hope it helped you a lot. Don't forget to subscribe and activate the bell to receive notifications of new videos.